September arrives as a month of sacred transition, a bridge between the vibrant fullness of summer and the serene introspection of autumn. It is a time when nature begins to slow down, inviting us to pause, reflect, and plant new intentions for the coming cycles. Under this changing sky, the moon becomes our luminous compass, guiding us day by day in its eternal dance of expansion, fullness, and rebirth. Each of its phases reminds us that life also breathes in cycles. Moments to grow with courage, times to release with gratitude, and spaces of silence where the seed prepares itself in the invisible. On this lunar journey in September, you will have the opportunity to connect with your inner energy, listen to the messages the moon brings for you, and walk hand in hand with it toward a new beginning. We are Phase Lunar, and we invite you to travel with us through this 30-day celestial calendar, a map where every sunrise and every sunset holds a purpose and a lesson. Let's begin the day-by-day -day journey of the moon phases in September. September 1st. The moon is in its waxing gibbous phase with 66.7% illumination. It's a time for growth and confidence. Today, every decision you make will bring you closer to fullness. September 2nd. With 75.9% light, the energy accelerates. This day is ideal for consolidating what you started at the beginning of the month. September 3rd. The moon grows to 84.4%. Its glow invites us to showcase what we have been nurturing. Dare to share your projects. September 4th. With 91.4% illumination, the lunar magnetism intensifies. It's a good day to strengthen confidence and reaffirm your intentions. September 5th. The moon shines at 96.7%. The culmination is near. It is time to polish details and prepare your spirit for what will be revealed in the coming days. September 6th. At 99.6%. The nearly full moon anticipates a day filled with anticipation. The very air feels electric, as if the universe is about to show you something great. September 7th. The full moon gives us its total splendor at 100%. But this day is even more special. A total lunar eclipse occurs, the second and last of the year. It will be visible at dusk from Africa and Europe, and at dawn in Australia, Japan, and New Zealand. It is a portal of transformation, a reminder that even in moments of shadow, Light always returns. Take advantage of this magical night to give thanks for what you have experienced and release what has completed its cycle. September 8th. After its fullness, the moon begins its waning path with 99.7% light. Today, the energy invites calm and reflection. September 9th. With 96.9% illumination, it's a day to observe what the full moon revealed to you. Listen carefully to your inner voice. September 10th. The moon descends to 91.3%. It's a time for assimilation. What you have experienced must transform into learning. September 11th, at 83.2%, introspection deepens. Dedicate time to yourself without hurry, without demands. September 12th, today the moon drops to 73.1%. Detachment becomes necessary. Recognize which burdens you can let go of. September 13th, with 61.8% light, the sky asks you for clarity and discernment. September 14th, we reach the third quarter with 50%. This is a great portal of liberation, a time to forgive, to cut ties, and to leave behind what should no longer be with you. September 15th, with 38.4% illumination, the energy lowers and invites you to inner silence. September 16th, the moon descends to 27.6%. It's a good day to take care of yourself and protect your energy. September 17th, with 18.2% light, melancholy may appear. Allow yourself to feel, but also to trust the process of transformation. September 18th, illumination drops to 10.5%. Today, everything invites you to rest, to let go of control. September 19th, with 4.9%, the waning moon shows us the importance of closing with love. September 20th, the light descends to 1.3%. This is a day of surrender and giving yourself over to the universe. September 21st, the new moon arrives with 0% light. The sky empties to give you a blank canvas. This is a perfect moment to plant your intentions for the next cycle. September 22nd, the waxing moon resurfaces with 0.8%. A thread of light announces new beginnings. September 23rd, with 3.6% illumination, the seed is already planted. Today, nurture your desires with faith. September 24th, the moon reaches 8.2%. It's a day to explore new ideas. September 25th, with 14.4% light, inspiration expands. Allow creativity to flow. 
September 26. The moon grows to 21.9%. Today is a good day to take concrete steps in what you have started. September 27. With 30.4% illumination, confidence begins to solidify. September 28. The moon shows 39.8% light. The energy is one of openness and collaboration. September 29th. We reach the first quarter with 49.7%. This is a point of decision and action. The universe urges you to move forward with clarity. September 30th. We close a month with a waxing gibbous moon at 59.9%. The energy is strong and optimistic, paving the way for October. And so ends our lunar journey in September. A month marked by the transformative power of the eclipse and the lesson of letting go to be reborn. Remember, there is always a time to grow and expand, and another to retreat and heal. Both are sacred. Thank you for joining us on this journey.